Welcome to your weekly UAS News Update. This is the week of August 29th, 2022, and this week we have five stories. The first one is, well, more leaks from DJI with the Mavic 3 Enterprise that is leaked. We'll talk about some uh, rogue drones that stop firefighting activities. We'll talk about a drone tracking tech that was installed at uh, LAX Airport. And then there's a few key events that are right around the corner. And then lastly, we have some, well, more deep dive courses and then more to come. So let's get to it. First thing this week is the Mavic 3 Enterprise seems to have been leaked. Uh, there was an image shown on Deal's drone, uh, potentially showing the payload for the Mavic 3 Enterprise. Uh, currently, there are no specs at this stage on the Mavic 3 Enterprise. And with that being said, uh, typically DJI drones that are on the Enterprise lineup don't really get leaked as much as the other ones. Uh, we saw that with the Matrice 30 all of a sudden, one day to the next. Here it is released and kind of uh, quietly too as well. So the Mavic 3 Enterprise is expected to be released or announced at DJI Airworks which is right around the corner in a few weeks. So if you want more information, we'll put links to, uh, to our friend Haya's website, uh, Drone Excel, and then you can see what's going on over there. And then the next story this week is in Montana where a rogue drone was seen uh, delaying firefighting efforts. The firefighters were able to chase the drone back to the owner. Uh, they said that they were able to chase the drone down the hill and then they found a bunch of kids that uh, pointing out to where the drone was coming from. Uh, they found the person, they called the police department and then they were able to respond within minutes. Uh, just remember when there is any kind of firefighting efforts, uh, there might be helicopters involved. You do not want to be out there flying. I know you probably want to see what's going on, but please don't send you drone, uh, whether that's for firefighting or for any kind of other first responder uh, activities. All right, next story is uh, drone tech has been installed at LAX, and this is uh, because of what happened. You may, you may remember the guy in jetpack sightings that we talked about uh, at LAX. So uh, TSA will be testing the new technology to track drones. Uh, if you haven't seen our video from Aerial Armor, I uh, recommend that you go take a look. This is the kind of technology that would be installed around on these airports. Uh, TSA reports that there has been uh, 38 drone sighting at LAX so far this year. Uh, obviously around big airports, we wanna make sure that we uh, stay away from areas or altitudes where we're not supposed to fly uh, just to uh, keep everybody safe. Next thing is a few upcoming events. We talked about these recently. There is a commercial UAV expo, which is happening next week. We'll be out there September 6 to 8 in Las Vegas. And then right after that, I'll be going to Colorado for the UAS Roundup. This is on September 11th to 12th in uh, Mount Princeton, Colorado. Uh, there I'll actually be talking on a panel about uh, beyond visual line of sight. I'll be talking with John McBride from uh, from uh, Autel, and I'm pretty excited about that. Then we have DJI Airworks, that's October 10th to 12th in Las Vegas. And then lastly, we have the drone race, which I will not be at, but uh, if you wanna go see that at the PayPal Park in San Jose, California. Uh, we said that last week, but we have discounts for tickets. It's only $15 uh, per person for Pilot Institute students and uh, friends and family discount. We'll put a link down in the description for that. All right, last thing this week is deep dive galore. We have been releasing deep dive courses left and right. Uh, we started with the DJI Avada last week, and now we have the paired Anafi AI. Uh, if you're not familiar with that drone, it's a little bit different. It has a, a 4G chip, and it's uh, it flies differently. It's really cool. You can see all the technology. It looks different, very, very different than most of the drones we've seen. And then we have the Matrice 30 that's uh, being released as well as a deep dive course, and we also have the Matrice 300. So we've been uh, cranking up these uh, deep dive courses. We have more to come. We are also working on our mapping courses, and and then we have three of these that are in the pipeline that our editing team is working on, which we should have released by the end of the month. So look out for those. Uh, we're really excited about them. A ton of information. If you've never done anything with mapping before and you want to get into it and you're interested, we'll have an introduction course and then we'll have more advanced courses as well uh, that you can use. So uh, stay posted. Uh, as always, you know, like, subscribe. We'll be posting more content about this. If you have any questions, uh, we're happy to help. So that's it. That's all I have. I'll see you guys next week. Thank you.